Hey y'all, it's Chris and Tammy with Collard Valley Cooks. We went to the grocery store because I was out of quite a few things. So we're getting ready to cook for the holidays. I'm going to try to do chicken and dressing, sweet potato souffle, uh, an Italian cream cake, and a chocolate cake all this week. Now, you've already seen the chocolate cake. I'm just taking it with me home because we're traveling to go to our hometown. If you're a local and you live in the Cedartown area, Lord willing, I will be at the Collard Valley Baptist Church booth at the Fall Festival Saturday, this coming up Saturday. Anyway, the Fall Festival in Cedartown. I should be there, and not only that, but I'm hoping because we had to revise that Volume 1 cookbook, and we've been having to mark it up to everybody that we mail it to because of the chicken and dressing, Lord willing, I'm going to have quite a few boxes there with me and if you make a purchase at the Collard Valley Baptist table at the Fall Festival, you will get our Volume 1 cookbook free. What about that? So, um, that's big news. So, y'all share it if you're local to the area or if you live in Rome or around in there and you want to come see us. And uh, we'll see you then. All right. I'm going to show you what we got at the grocery store. I don't even know what we spent because you know how you scan your card before you pay and it approves it. I did that. Me and Chris bagged groceries. So I got celery for the dressing, whole buttermilk for the cornbread, I got some taco shells for me and Chris to have a taco salad this week. You get these in the refrigerated section. Cream cheese. You can never have too much this time of year. Chris got some contact solution. And I got two lipsticks and a mascara. My favorite lips liner is Revlon Color Stay. And so I got two colors and some voluminous mascara while I was there. We have an enormous Kroger. They had these um, deal of the week, $4.99 for these prep bowls. And I always buy a lot of them to put leftovers in for the kids when they come. And so I got a bunch of those. Got two boxes. Two sections of those. Chris got mini weights. Wheat checks. They were all on sale. And then I got throwaway pans for my holiday cooking. I got the regular 13 by 9, and I got the deeper one for dressing. Now look, if you make my dressing and you make it really deep, it takes a long time to cook it. So get ready for a long cook time. And let me make sure I didn't, this is my receipt in here. I don't know that I'm gonna look at that yet. What else? We got romaine, American, salad blend. We've been eating salads a good bit. And I got some Halloween candy. Just the candy candy, not the chocolate. I don't have any idea how many trick-or-treaters we're going to have here in this new house. In this new neighborhood. Um, there's a lot of kids that live in this neighborhood, ain't there, Chris? Oh, yeah. So we'll probably have a lot. I got some boar's head honey roasted turkey. I got, they had these on sale, already shredded hash browns that are in the refrigerated section or fresh potatoes, and I'm going to make hash brown casserole or something out of these. And then you got butter. At Kroger this week, they had their butter for the deal of the week, $2.49, only if you clip the coupon before you go. That's cheap. 
And yes, I had to get some white lily. I'm completely out of white lily self-rising flour. So I got that. And I got cornmeal mix because I'm about to make a bunch of cornbread. Can't never leave that out. This is my dog's favorite treats. They're, it's duck meat wrapped around sweet potatoes. They love them. So I got them those. They were on sale. Chris got some granola bars to eat on the boat. They had these on sale, so I got some Lipton onion soup mix packs. Chris got some oatmeal. And I was completely out of paprika, so I got some paprika. I got to fill up my paprika jar. This is what I like to eat for breakfast. I eat this for breakfast a lot of the time. And um, the crunchy ones, I don't like the chewy ones. I like the crunchy ones. My favorite is almond, and they don't sell those here. They don't hardly sell them anymore. Um, so I, I settle with what I can get. Look at this giant box of Lucky Charms Chris got. Now, he is eating better, but for dessert, it's a lot less calories for him to eat a small bowl of sweet cereal than it is to eat another kind of dessert. And we also got something else he likes to have. I'll show it to you. More butter. Y'all are about to see what I snack on. Okay. This is my chicken I got for my dressing. I always boil a chicken. I put chicken in my dressing. Look how big this young, fresh chicken is. It's a big one. Ain't that a big chicken? Um, we also got chicken wings. We are going to make some oven chicken wings because we need to do it. I don't have a video on my website for that recipe, and it's just something we need to make. And somebody did say something to Chris because some of y'all know that Chris, if you watch my Real Southern Woman channel, you know that Chris is having some test run and stuff. And um, they had gotten on this for frying chicken. And can I say that I make stuff for this show. Um, we don't pig out on it, but I have to make it. And, uh, and of course, he did eat some fried chicken. He just didn't lose any weight that day, did you, Chris? But I don't think he gained weight that day either, did you? Nope. So he watches what he eats. And at the fall festival, I plan on making some cake, slicing it and putting it in these bowls and wrapping it with plastic wrap and selling it at the table in Cedar Town on Saturday. We were out of olive oil, so I, this is my favorite olive oil. A lot of y'all ask me, and this is my favorite brand of olive oil. I got some sweet onions to make my dressing with. I do have two pumpkins for making pumpkin pie, and I may make a couple of pumpkin pies and slice them and take them to the um, sale as well. Chris has to get milk, of course. Lightly salted chips is our favorite. And then he likes these hot potato chips. I don't eat them. My chickens are not laying right now. They are uh, molting, losing all their feathers. I haven't gotten an egg in over a week and a half. So I had to buy eggs. Um, got sweet potatoes for our sweet potato souffle. And these are beautiful sweet potatoes. Look how pretty they are. Isn't that pretty? And then um, this is our favorite coffee. Cafe Verona is our favorite. Okay. And y'all are going to see my weakness. Some of y'all already know what it is. M&M's. And they had them on sale. So I got two bags. Yes, I did. I eat these. At night, this is my nighttime snack, so I get my peanuts and chocolate in at the same time, and I love them. 
So, and I guess that's it. Ain't it, Chris? Oh, I was going to let you see um, what? What? Oh, you want me to tell them what? I don't know if I want to tell them what I spent, but I guess I can. Okay, all right. And then I got two boxes of fudge bars because we love fudge bars. One is only 100 calories, and they're so delicious. So this is what we got. Ta-da! Found it. For a grand total of, we bought some expensive stuff, M&M's, candy. Those M&M's were $11.99 a pack. The candy is high. Y'all know how high Halloween candy is this year. I got those. I mean, we bought a lot of expensive stuff. Olive oil. A whole thing of chicken wings was $20-something. $20.59. All for a grand total of... Oh, holy smokes. Does anybody want to guess? Before I give you the grand total? Like, this is expensive, too. These are real expensive items. These were eleven ninety nine a piece. Let's see how much that coffee is just by itself. Is anybody guessing? Y'all don't want to guess. Three forty nine. One person says two fifty. Two hundred. Two thirty. Okay. Two fifty. Six hundred. Six hundred. Three twenty five. <laughs> Da -da -da -dum. Da -da -da -dum. Savings today, total coupon savings was $64.53. But the grand total was $342.62. You're the winner on the price is right. The one that guessed $350 or $60? Three forty-two. So that's what we saw. That's what we spent. Now we got to cook and eat, but we got a lot of big stuff. Okay, groceries are outrageous. I mean, outrageous. Like those those uh, treats for the dogs are twenty dollars. This is twenty dollars. These were five dollars a piece on sale. I mean, a lot of this stuff is high-priced stuff. I don't even know what that candy cost. Let's look and see what that candy costs. Now, I didn't get chocolate candy. But we already have a bunch of candy. You need to help me. Yes, we already have a thing of bubble gum and a bag of, another bag of chocolate candy. Let's see. Starbucks coffee is $31.99. Um... The duck jerky for the dogs was $19.99. The lemon head candies were $15.99. Yeah. So anyway, that's it. That's our grocery haul. Um, after I go to the grocery store, that is absolutely all I do. I come home, I put it up, and that's all I do for the day. All right? So I will be in the kitchen cooking tomorrow. And y'all watch the fried chicken video. I'm going to post it on Facebook today. I, I posted it on YouTube already, but we will download it and play it. I'm going to play it like it's alive. And what time is it now, Chris? One. I'll play it at 2 o'clock. So y'all watch our fried chicken video. It's some good fried chicken. All right? Y'all have a blessed day. And as always, we thank you for watching Colored Valley Cooks, where we cook like our mamas did. Bye, y'all. Love you.